Okay, this is a demo of Crafty Syntax Live Help, which is an open source life support system that allows for multiple operators on multiple departments on multiple different websites and visitors can be proactively invited and chatted simultaneously on the same system. And it is all customizable and it includes lots of features including page traffic, page tracking, analytics, and some basic uh, plugin options that I can go through uh, in other video demos, but this is just a basic tour. Uh, first off, um, you create multiple different departments. Now you can, in the departments tab, now you can create departments for the same website, such as billing and tech support and uh, all that for one site, or you can create um, multiple departments for different websites all in the same uh, system. So in this example, I have two different websites, one with two two departments and one with only the basic department. Now, all of the graphics and colors and, and top part of the screen are all set in the settings. So in here, I have for Valiant Roadrunners, it has a Valiant Roadrunners header to it, and it's got its own color and its own theme to it and its own questions and its own online and offline icons and then the same goes for the department for the uh, Maui Marathon settings it has its own other header part and its own theme so when you uh, go here and you've created the two you can then click on generate HTML which then asks you which department you want to generate the code for uh, and then uh, you're setting it to a, a website outside of this installation and you click create and it will give you a, a small bit of JavaScript code that you cut and paste onto your website to monitor that site and chat or proactively chat with the visitors to the site. So let's start off again with uh, I've already generated the code for these two departments, the general and the value and I've put them on their uh, the site which is right here for this site so uh, we will go to the live help tab and that will be where we monitor the visitors and for chat requests now we don't have to have this window open and staring at it all the time the live help system will alert us of these chats as they come in by focusing this window and ringing when chat request uh, comes in so this is the sound alert and it's checked so I will hear a ring when uh, the chat comes in and I'll also hear it um, I'll also have it focus there are also uh, other things you can do such as install the Windows application which will have in your Windows dock a uh, alert system which will alert you of chats or you can plug in the Firefox plugin which will add crafty syntax into your browser window and alert you with chats so those are other options of uh, alerting you when chats are on so you do not have to keep looking at the chat screen because it will just alert you when the chat comes in so to demonstrate that I'm going to go back to the uh, Roadrunner website and I am going to initiate a chat so here's the chat questions I have a question and I'm going to send. Now, in a moment, it will alert me of that chat request and it will focus the window. So you see the window popped up on its own, it focused and it rang. So I have a chat request coming in, I can activate it or I can ignore it, and that chat request then shows up at the bottom dock of the screen, and again, away we go with chatting with that person. On the client side, you see your operator image, that's also changeable by whoever the operator that answered the chat is, or it could be taken out entirely, the graphics for this, and you can start chatting. Now, another great feature is Craft Syntax has a preview option for the operator and the visitor, and that can show what the visitor is typing as they are typing it, so you don't have to wait for them to type their life story on, a, on their, their screen. So, for example, I have a question about the now you see as uh, the text is typing here it is showing up in a typing preview here as they type it 
so you can read their question and start responding to it even before they click on enter and that preview option is customizable by either you can see just what they say or they can see also what you're saying as you type it as well um, if you don't want them to see what you're typing uh, you can change that on this drop menu to operator is typing and view the visitors typing or just see what the visitors is typing or have done just no typing preview box at all which is uh, just so that there's no pre you just don't see what they're typing until they finish it um, that is pretty useful and now I'm going to uh, show you on the other website proactively inviting someone to chat. So here we go to this other website and it also has the same monitoring system on it but instead of waiting for this customer to uh, chat I am going to find them which is right here and I can see that they're on that page and I can invite them to chat with us proactively. So here are uh, layer invites that are uploaded into a layer page that you can create your own and you can send them this picture and we click on send on their side a chat request comes in uh, floats on in and says do you have questions click here for live help on the crafty syntax it says that the layer invite has this denotes that the layer invite has been sent to them and that they are looking at it and this right here when they click on it brings up that chat and Bob has a question yes I do have questions thanks for asking click send and again it will proactively uh, pop up alert us the chats here and focus the window we click on activate and now we are talking to two different people at the same time on the same screen now to denote the different chats there is a color for each of the channels so bob is blue eric is yellow but character syntax has multiple different ways of uh stylizing this to your preference if you don't want to see all the chats in one page you can break these chats off into their own windows or you can use this eye icon to just see Bob or just see Eric. Now, using this arrow with a uh, star will break that Bob chat into its own window. So, and you can do the same thing with the other chat. So you can break Eric's to its own window as well. If you've lost the window and pile of windows that you've got, you can find it by clicking on that tab and there is locate that window here it will find that window and bring it to the focus so uh, I have Bob and I have um, Eric side by side and you can put both windows side by side start chatting to them side by side and, and answering them in cascaded windows of talking to your clients so that is the basics of talking to multiple people on multiple different websites with, with um, uh, the same system and the basics of character syntax you can also in the options send them URLs or canned responses or messages that you've already created or pictures that you've pre-uploaded in the settings pages uh, so that you, if you have a canned response that you've already uh, created you can uh, click options select that and then you can edit it and change it and send it to them so that is the basics of chatting to multiple people uh, just to go over the analytics and basically is in the data tab you can uh, see in the past you can see for example how many people from this website went on to the other websites and what percentage of them they were so from the VR page 52 percent of people ended the page while 31 percent ended up went going from that page to the upcoming events page and so on and you have the other things such as keywords what keywords brought them to your page how many visitors for that month for that you can search you can see referrers you can see messages you can see transcripts you can see what users came to your page because each user will be after they chat they're cookied and forever known as that username and you can see when they have visited how how many times they visited and their total amount of time on the site 
and you can um, get more documentation on more features and plugins for character syntax by clicking on documentation. Uh, so that is, in a nutshell, the very basics of character syntax. There is so much more to do to this uh, system, but this is just the quick and uh, great overview. I hope you liked it. Uh, check out the YouTube channel for other videos as they come in. So.